Hey guys, Gears of Thrills here, and we're back again with some more Sons of the Forest. So, update. Yep, we're in the normal playthrough this time around. We're not messing around, we're actually uh, going to keep this progress. We need to find a golf cart, and um, what better place to find one than the golf course we are actually on. So, I think, if I remember, when I was messing around, I'm pretty sure there's one over this side. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to get the go, go cart. Go-kart would have been cool. Golf cart. And then I feel like we should go down and get ourselves the rifle. Because everyone loves a good rifle. And then once we've got that, I feel like we should go out and terrorize some more cannibals. Where is the golf cart? I'm pretty sure there's one. There was one around here. I know there was one around here. Unless they're random spawns. I'll run around and I'll find one. There's got to be one here. I'm at the bloody golf course, you know. Unless it's up here. There we go. Found one. Knew it was it. Still can't change the keys, unfortunately. It won't let me. It uh, crashes the game out and I have to exit. So, we are... Now I need to get out of this. Uh, that one. We need to go and get the rifle. I'm pretty sure the rifle's in the cave directly south from where I'm standing. So, if you look at the map, directly north on the map, where that cave is, right near that river, I'm pretty sure that is where the uh, the rifle is. The big cave, the big horrible cave that no one really likes, you know. I'm, uh, I'm going to have to head in there, unfortunately. I'm probably not going to record that because no one wants to watch me go through that cave system again. I don't even want to watch me go through that cave system again, but I've got to do it. So I feel like I'm going to drive really terrible with this. And is that a slinky? That's a friggin' slinky. Can I have him in this? I wasn't. It was a big cannibal. Right. Come here, mate. See if I can run him over. And... Uh, that was basically no damage. Okay, well, let's just get the head out of it. Alright. It is a lot quicker, actually, getting around in this thing, I must say. I figured it's so much easier if I just head to the beach, drive straight along the coastline, because it's nice and flat, right? Well, flattish. And then we should be there. I haven't got to deal with any trees. I haven't got to deal with anything, really. No cannibals, nothing. It'd be nice. Nice, peaceful little drive as long as it stops rearing off to the right. I should be absolutely fine. All right, we made it just in time. The uh, car is just about to run out of batteries, to be honest. It uh, didn't last very long. I don't know if you can change them. I haven't got to that stage of it actually running out. It's got a solar panel on top, though, so I'm kind of hoping it just charges itself up. Uh, I couldn't get down there completely. Although, I could have just driven down this way, couldn't I? Doesn't matter. I'll just drop down. Right. I'll get to the cave entrance. I'll show you on the map where it is. Here we are. This is the big, horrible, demon, broke, horrible cave place. You know, it's that one that's massive and pointless. Uh, it's where you get the gold armor from. That's the one. So, we're here on the map. We're on the other side of the island. Golf course is up there to the north. Uh, you got the bunker over there, and you got the other bunkers down there. The end game bunker is actually that blip directly that way. But oh well, apparently it is in here, and this is where we can find it. So I'm gonna get my ass in here. I'm gonna run it quick. I'm not gonna take my time. I'm gonna try and write down the directions I go, just so you guys can have a, a like an in and out direction. So you just get in, get it, go. No one likes the caves in this game, do they? Really. This is new. Never noticed this in the cave before. If I remember, they added cannibal uh, camps and stuff, or small camps, didn't they, inside the caves? Nice of them to chop up the body for me. It means I haven't got to do it. Thank you very much. Yeah, I've never noticed this before. This is very new. Strange, though. No cannibals. About right. Hopefully, they got rid of all the bloody mutants. So far, I haven't got very far. I've basically straight through the front door. I turned right and then carried on going. Okay, so I've already got it. <laughs> I didn't mean to pick it up. Uh, I came into the cave, went right, followed it through, went down into the water, swam through, and then ran in a straight line. Uh, you'll see like loads of little cannibal lights. I can't show you exactly where I am. And this dude down here has got the rifle, which is nice got some ammo for it too what i might do is i might run the rest of the cave quickly just see if there's any more ammo in here for it and then i'll get the hell out of here 
All right, we are out of the cave. Now that I've got to try and find the rifle in my bag. Where is it? I'm very crap at spotting things. Ah, there it is. Can we? Like, I don't... Oh, no, we can't. Let's have a little look at that. Oh, that looks nice. Yeah, I like that. That is good. Oh, it's got a scope and everything. Can we not put a silencer on this? Can we put a silencer on this, please? No, we cannot. Right, I'm going to eat. I'm going to drink. And then I feel like we're going to head down to the beach and see about um, terrorizing some cannibals. I'm going to get some leaf armor on as well, I think. Oh, I can't just drink water anymore. You've got to boil it, haven't you? Well, we need ammo as well, so I'm going to hit that bunker. That one just over there. I'm going to get the car, which is up there. We'll hit that bunker. We'll see if there's any ammo in there. And then we'll hit the other bunker whilst we head down to the beach to terrorize some more uh, cannibals. I love that beach location. There's just so many of them down there. Oh, hello. Didn't know you were here. You guys literally get everywhere, don't you? Can I run up here? I cannot. Oh, look at that. The car does recharge itself. That's good to see. Well, I'm glad about that. Because that would be a massive pain in the ass if we had to do it ourselves. I need, the only problem is it's really annoying is we can't check the map out. Where are we going? We've got to drive all the way around the lake and down there. Right, got it. Let's go. We need like a sat-nav. Just something that you can mark up on the map of where you want to go. And then it's just like, turn left in a hundred yards sort of thing, you know? I'd make a great sat-nav sat voice. All right, so I ran that bunker. There was no uh, no ammunition in there for the rifle. I'm not too sure where to get it from. I'm just going to run around and drive around until I've come across like random camps. See if there's any in those ammo boxes that drop at the camps. Hopefully there is. If there is, and then we can proper kit ourselves up with some ammunition and then go to town on some cannibals, really, can't we? That's what I want to do. Wow, this, uh, I'm running out of batteries in my car. I'm down at one bar, and my god, it is going slow. It still drives, but, like, not as much as I'd hope. I've hit a couple of camps. Uh, found some ammo crates, got a couple of bits of ammo, so doing all right. I don't know how much exactly I've got. I'll add it all up in a bit, I think. Come on. Oh, get out and push. Come on. Get your ass up there. There we go. Right, what I'm thinking of doing, I'm going to give my car a little bit of time to charge. And I'm going to go and make myself some... Uh, it's not working, is it? I'm not gathering anything like that. I want to uh, gather myself some leaves, although I, th I think I'm maxed out on leaves. I'm going to give it time to charge. I'm going to make myself some cloth or... Um, what is it? That bush armor stuff. I, I want to go all bushy on them. I want to be proper stealthy. Well, guys, looks like it's on foot from here. Ah, <laughs> oh, god damn it. I just got it. It's proper stuck. Right, proper stuck. Come on. No, there's no getting that out of there, is there? I don't want that. Ah, oh, that sucks. That really sucks. Come on. I can't even get out. I'm so stuck in this hole. All right. On foot it is then. Bloody hell. All right. Turns out I wasn't that far away anyway. Got quite a nice bit of ammo. <laughs> Let's have a little look, see what we can do here. So I'm fully bushed up. I am a I am a bush. I'm at one with the bushes. Let's see what we can do. Let's turn the sensitivity down. Let's hope that they don't see me. I don't even think I've reloaded the gun. Oh, I don't need to. Ready? Oh, that is loud. Oh, come on. I hit the bush. Well, oh, they didn't even move. Uh, they're not even flinching. Nothing. It's just standing there. All right, next. Crap it. Oh, hit the tent. They're not doing anything. They're literally just standing there. Oh! <laughs> Headshot. Oh, that was great. I'm going to reload. Right, they're moving now. I think it just took them a bit of time to realise that I just popped one of their cronies in the head. Oh, yeah. Do they know where I am now? Oh, man, this feels good. I'm in the bush. I'm fully bushed. They know where I am. I'm fully bushed up, guys. You shouldn't be seeing me. Same fair. 
I'm meant to be... St Why aren't I running? What's going on? Am I jumping? There we go. Oh, crap. Uh, sorry, mate, but... You can have one in the throat. No? You don't want one in the throat? Oh, let's try it again. Right between the eyes instead, then. That'll do it. Surely that should do it. You ain't getting up after that. No. Good, good, good. Yeah, that's right. Run away. I've just done your gold guy in the face. Let's see if I can... Uh, I'm going to see if I can lose them. And... Ah! Oh! <laughs> I'm going to see if I can lose them and get them reset so I can actually stealth them. Right. I think I lost them. I'm going to see what it's like if I pop one of them with uh, a handgun with a silencer. Why is he standing up now? Crouch. There we go. I don't like how he just stands up automatically. Let me see if I can... They're not going to know where it's coming from. Like, surely they shouldn't know where it's coming from. I love stealth in these cannibal camps. They're great. There we go. That poor sod down there has got no idea what's hitting him. I mean, it'd be in an awful lot of pain, surely. One more for him then. Why is he not dead yet? I've hit him so many times. Dude, die. He's immortal. Well, he's not bloody immortal now. Right, now let's get the sniper out. I'm a bit of a distance away. I'm a further away from this camp, and I'm fully bushed. Turn the sensitivity down. She's crying over him. Ah, oh, poor girl. Poor girl. Oh. I know the rifle's loud, but I'm literally in a bush. Maybe the maybe the leaf farmer does work. Because he's just walked straight past me. Literally straight past me. And he didn't even know I was there. Let's shoot me in the ass. Ready? Oh. <laughs> oh, this is good. I could do this all day. He knows where I am, though. Uh-oh. He's changed his mind. I don't know if he's... Oh. Yeah, that was a bull shot. I'm enjoying this. This rifle is good. This is fun. Oh, he got back up. Oh. Uh oh. Uh oh. No, I don't know where I am. Oh. Okay. Just That's the first time I've undressed anybody with a rifle. I'll take it. Is she, like, running? I think she's running away from me. I don't think she's actually after me. Okay. Well, she's bolting. Let's, uh... Oh my days. Oh, I'm doing... Come on. This is a high-powered rifle. It should be stripping their armor off. And... Wow, he's just, just... I don't even know what that was. Saved by the tree? Ain't saved now, are you, you jerk? You took a bullet in the back of the head. I'm going to keep doing this. This is fun. Uh oh He does... He literally doesn't know where I am. I'm like a ghost. Look at them, look. They're just they're literally just walking straight past me. They haven't got a clue. Okay, so Leaf Armor is actually really good for stealth. Let's see, just pop this one in the back of the head. Meatball. Oh, just took his armor off. Let's see what he does. See if he comes over. See if he knows where I am. I don't think he does. He can't see me. V. No, you're going to ruin everything, V. Don't do it. V, v don't do it. I'm stealthy. Virginia, get your bush armor on. Go away. You're going to ruin it. Oh. She hasn't done anything yet. Let's uh, let's reposition. I had to get away from V. She's uh, unloading into him over there. Hopefully they'll take her down and then... Nope. Maybe I was wrong. Here we go. Boom. Oh. So satisfying. You can run, but you can't hide unless the game despawns you like that. Oh, mate. I'm not going to be able to get him. I'm not very good at aiming. Oh. Saying that, just popped him in the chest. Oh, reload. Right. <laughs> v. V, go away. Oh, my God. Calvin's it. Oh, uh, that one knows where I am. I believe that one just got... Saved by a tree. Oh, I can't be stealthy now, can I? I've got Calvin in a space suit. I've got Virginia standing behind me with a shotty, blowing everything up. Oh, crap. 
Get him, guys. Get him. Oh, he's running at me, V. You attracted them all to me. Ow. I'd like to know... Mate, leave my leaf armor alone. I'd like to know what uh, what damage this gun actually does. Like, actual damage-wise. Because I don't have a clue. Oh, I missed. I missed that one. Oh, well. Let's go wipe out the camp. Got me buckshots out. Might as well... Calvin's already in there. Nice. Okay. Great. Amazing. Thanks, Calvin. Bloody sod running through the camp. This one's injured. Bless him. <laughs> it never gets old. It never gets old. This is amazing. Calvin, duck! I did say duck. That was a risky shot. I could have killed Calvin then. Get up, dude. Tell you what. You do find quite a lot of... Uh, quite a lot of rifle ammo in these bases. I just picked up loads from a crate. It's, it's um, uh, maybe it's a bit too much. I don't, I don't know. I don't know what the normal amount of uh, ammo spawns meant to be, but that was quite a bit. I still want to be able to build a boat. Right. Well, that's that done. I've lost my uh, golf cart, but there's one on the beach. I can pick one up on the way home. I think we should just head home then. There's nothing left to do here. Everybody's dead. If they're not dead, they ran away. Right, testing out the night viz. I found myself a bush. You can't really see through the scope, but... Oh, God, that muzzle flash just almost blinded me. Works, though. It does work. Uh... Oh, I didn't reload. They know where I am. Run away. Let's get, let's get the shotgun out. Come on, then. Yeah, that's right. Let's just have it. Come on. Why do you keep switching the buckshot? Stop it. It's crap. Not buckshot. Bloody slugs. That's the one. Stop switching the slugs. I want buckshot. Every time I put my gun away, it switches over. Can't get any more annoying. Look at that. Look, it's a murder bush. Yes. Murder bush for everybody. Oh. Like a little episode of Doom, innit? Let's go. Cue the Doom music. I would if it wouldn't get demonetized. And then I'd get a copyright strike. Because I'm pretty sure that crap is copywritten. Right. Oh well. Done. That's it. Might as well head home. Raid the camp. Death by firing squad. Feel a bit rude if I didn't, wouldn't it? Yeah, kind of had to. Kind of had to do that. I could not. Oh, my days. I couldn't not do that. Oh, my days. All right, I might. I tell you what, I'll let you live. Yeah, you can live. Apparently, you've got plot armor and you can't die. Uh, You can tell all your friends. Kills for Grills was here. I love the golf cart. I'll tell you what they need to add or what I'd like to see. If they add it further on down the line, that'd be cool. A horn. So at least I can bib at them as I'm running them over. Just to, you know, terrorize them that little bit more. And headlights and the ability to be able to store stuff on the back. Or a trailer, like a little trailer. That would be pretty cool. Get a little trailer on the back. Fill it up with um, with stones and logs or whatnot. Whatever you need. And then just uh, drive it home. Obviously, you can tell that I'm doing a horrendous job here because I'm looking for the road. And I drove past where I was meant to go. It's not easy getting up onto the golf course. It's a bit of a pain in the ass. There we go. Made it home. Kind of. I had to swap out my golf cart. Pick up another one on the way here. Because it ran out of batteries. Night time. So it's not charging. Obviously. But it's... That's a sledge. I thought I'd added a new... Uh, bloody cannibal camp. Like right next door to my base then. That would have sucked. Alright. Let's get this open. Let's get this in here. Will I fit through that? Oh, do you know what? I'm not even going to risk it. I'll get stuck. And I won't be able to get in. Then I'll be fighting with it. Let's get this in here. I'm going to have to build a car park now, aren't I? Somewhere I can park all my golf carts. There we go. Look at that. I might even be able to fill it in the sledge area. Do you know what? I'm going to give it a go. No, don't. Oh, shut myself out. Right. Here we go. Will it let me? <laughs> I think it will, you know. 
Let's try and line it up. Perfect. Let's get it. Uh oh. Uh oh. No. Well, I mean, <laughs> it, uh, it's kind of parked, right? It, let me get this out. Yeah, let's uh, let's have that out. There we go. <laughs> <laughs> question is am i gonna be able to get in the car yes i can right can i get out uh kind of oh no let's let's get in it let's just drive out this is a bit of a and then i can push it in yeah we'll do that i'll push it in there we go i can't even move oh no it's, it's rolling come on god damn it i'll run around need to get lights up in this place as well fixed it nailed it right Water. I need water. I need to build some rain catchers. Uh, I would sleep, but I've got half of energy anyway, so it's a waste of time if I do. We'll get some water and some rain catchers done. Because we can't drink that now. It's dirty water. So if we drink it, it's going to make us ill, unfortunately. There we go. That's that bad boy done. That is up. Let's get some water in this pan. We can... Uh, I mean, I suppose it puts more of, an, or more of a priority to make actual soup now. Whereas before, I was kind of like not bothering making any food because there was just no point. Uh, I mean, there kind of was a point, but didn't really need to. All right, let's, uh, let's lob that in there. Get this fire going. And we'll make a Greg stew. I've got enough body parts. I believe it might be some Greg. It might be some John and some Dave. I don't know who it belonged to. Wait, I can't see a thing. Now, someone did say when I was saying I kind of want to have, like, the fires on permanently. Put a torch in there, but I don't think you can. I don't think it's going to let you. It just sits on the front. No, look, it doesn't see it as a place you can. That'll look silly. Ah, oh, that was a great idea, though. Get a torch in there. Would have been perfect. Bloody game. Right, anyway. Unload all my gear. So I don't take it all with me next time I go back out to camp. And then uh, we'll get ourselves sorted. Ah, you can store light bulbs now. Okay, well that's good. But they have slowed down the uh, the clicking of the, the storing things. How much cloth have I got on me? I'm alright. I think you can carry a hundred of them. My god, it is hammering it down outside in this game. I get a state of them off, technically. It's hammering it down in here as well because the ceilings are too high. In here though, absolutely fine. I'd like to see that fixed, like... I don't care if my ceilings are two, two and a half high. You know, it's a ceiling. It should just be completely waterproof, right? Um, despite the gap at the top, ignore that. I'll fix that. But I'd like to see that uh, improved at some point down the line. It's a bit, a bit stupid, to be honest. Right, let's get these all out on the shelf. All right, so feel like I'm going to leave that here. I've unloaded all my gear. I've got loads of ammo and bits and pieces now. I'm, I'm quite tempted to see if you can actually get the ammo out of these skin pouches as well for the rifle. It'd be pretty cool if you can. I don't think you can. I haven't tested it. I'll give it a test. I'll find out and let you guys know if it actually works that way. I'm going to go stand in here where it's not raining. See, look, it's not raining in there, but if I come up here, is it raining up here? No, it's not raining up here either. Yeah, I think it's got to be really low roofs. I love this place. This place looks so nice. But it's raining in here. Because it's slightly arched. Oh, I give up. <laughs> Sod you. Screw you, game. And you rainy crap. Right, yeah, I'm going to leave this one here. It's been a pretty good episode. I uh, enjoyed going around killing all the cannibals with my new rifle. Rifle looks amazing. I love it. Uh, I just would love to be able to put a silencer on the end of it. That would be amazing, too. Put a silencer on the end, and then we can proper stealth out some cannibals. Whoa, mouse went crazy. So yeah, thanks for coming, guys. Thanks for watching. If you like it, give it a thumbs up. If you want to see some more, subscribe. Also, uh, I have a Discord. Link is in the description. I also have a Patreon page as well. Um, link is in the description for that. Uh, my save game for the Patreon members of that tier is uploaded to Patreon. So if you fancy using this save game, you can. Head over there and you can download it and play away with the fort or whatever you want. So thanks for coming again, guys. See you in the next one. Bye. Mm -hmm.